Hey, it's Selena Tension, and I am making tuna for lunch today. Um, and the reason why I'm showing you how to do tuna is because at my old job, uh, the lady in the cafeteria, we were talking one day, and she told me a way, um, she told me how they make tuna, um, and added a little something extra that I never thought about. To me, that makes it less fishy, but, um... I use the Bumblebee Bumblebee Premium Filet Solid White Albacore Tuna. And to me, this by itself is less fishy than just regular tuna. And I think all white, any all white tuna is less fishy, but I like the Premium Filet. It just, I don't know, it just tastes better to me. Um, so, okay. And I use celery, um, chop up a little bit of celery, and red peppers and green onions. Or sometimes I'll use regular onions, but I had green onions left over, so I'm using that. And I like to add some pepper in it. It doesn't matter before or after you put your uh Mayo, goodness, it's not coming out. Okay, and I do use um, light Miracle Whip. Sorry, I'm not gonna have dry tuna, which I do eat dry tuna just out the can. Um, just add a little bit. Just to get it a little moist. Yum, yum, yum. Okay, and that's all I'm adding of the Miracle Whip. I guess maybe a tablespoon. I don't know. What do you think? So, the extra thing that I add is ranch dressing. And it gives it, to me, a really good taste. You know, ranch goes good with anything. So, I add a little, just a little, a little ranch dressing. And that's why I don't add too much Miracle Whip because I'm going to add another, you know, dressing in here so I don't need too much of ah. so yeah and that's it that's how I make my tuna um but like I said the little secret is to me the ranch dressing and <laughs> I want some more pepper I like the pepper taste um and that's it and I'll have it with a salad um this has been in my refrigerator since last week and it's looking a little brown, so I'm just probably going to eat it with maybe some crackers. Or I'll put it on a whole wheat pita bread, and I'll put salad on top of there, and then put the tuna on top of it and eat it, or just put it in a salad by itself. So that's how I make tuna. So try it out. Um, and that's what I usually eat for lunch uh, most days. It gets a little boring, but I do change it up sometimes. So try it out and let me know what you think. And head over to selenatention.com and get on my newsletter. And I will talk to you on my next video. Bye.